Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Banished. It's your boy, John. We're back in Amesburyport, and uh, our villagers right now are, uh, they're farming. They're collecting food just like they should be. So uh, we're going to build off of the last episode. We're going to get this church built, and we're, we're going to build some other great things as we uh, as we go into the winter here. Before we get too far, just remember to uh, give these videos a like and uh, subscribe to my channel if you like these these videos that I make. It helps me to continue make these kinds of uh, these kinds of videos, this kind of content, and I really appreciate it. All right, let's move around a little bit. Let's uh, let's situate ourselves here. So we've got the quarry going. It's good. It still has a good amount of stone left, and we still have uh, a pretty decent amount of stone actually in storage, although we could bump that up a little bit. Go over here and check out the chapel. It's got a lot of resources. We still need about 40 stone left here, so they'll, they'll keep pulling it out of this hold to build that up. It's a lot of resource moving, to be completely honest. That's mostly what they're going to be working on. Our pasture here is doing really well. We've got five cows working out exactly how we want it. Food's getting collected. It's going to be our pepper field uh, going into next spring, so that's going to be really good. Give us some more food. Still have some houses that need to be built. Everything seems to be going pretty well so far. Everybody's out of a boarding house. They're into their own homes, which is great. We don't have enough berries, but you know, it is what it is. We're gonna we're gonna keep trying to get those berries. We only have three barrels of alcohol to get us through the winter, so hopefully that's enough. We do have a lot of labor on hand, so we'll be able to uh, to build up some of these jobs and have folks move around and and do stuff. Like, you know, we've got we're pretty we're pretty understaffed in Forester, we're pretty understaffed in in like m you know, some of the stone cutting and stuff like that, so be good for us to, to build up some stone, build the rest of those houses. As long as we're keeping an eye on our food, I think we'll be alright. Let's bump this speed back up. We, uh, we had that down just for a little bit while we were trading and, and doing some other things, but we're gonna bump that back up. See, we've got eight laborers going, which is fantastic. Looks like almost all the stone is brought over. Hopefully, they'll bring over that iron soon. All right, yo, they're doing it. Oh, cool, they start bringing the iron. Looks like they're bringing it from all the way over here, which is fine. Yeah, we do have some iron store over there. That's fine. Reserve of firewood is low. Not surprising. Not surprising at all. These guys are chugging away. We've only got 92. We did move some firewood around when we were trying to trade. How are we doing here? So we're full on firewood here, which is good. So they're going to stop pulling from the stores. And uh, so that'll stabilize a little bit. So we'll let that go for a little bit. We have two uh, we have two woodcutters, so they should be able to build that reserve back up quick, pretty quickly. And look at that, we're back up to almost 3,000 food. That's great. 2,500, 3,000. It's way better than we were uh, not that long ago. These folks still trekking out into the middle of nowhere to go grab stone, which is good. We really should try and deplete all of our all of our stone deposits around here. Um, in order to get over here, that we're gonna have to build some bridges and stuff. So maybe that'll be a task that we do in the in the near future. Right now, we've still got space to uh, to build out here, and we built a bridge over here too. We're expanding out here a little bit, so it's going well. Look at this! Look at they're doing it. They're doing it. Looks good. Looks really good. Sixty completed so far. Build, build, build. 
There we go. This will be nice. This will this will bring. Uh, oh no, I got somebody who's cold. Who is it? Uh, yeah, it's those folks who are going out into the middle of the wilderness. We still have some room to build out here too. We've got you know we've got a lot of opportunity in this general area. Build a chapel. That'll be great for this population of people over here. Uh, we've got 46 stone, so we probably could pop up another one in one of these houses. I think I'm going to do that once this chapel is built. Which is coming up pretty soon. Almost. Oh, man. This game is watching progress bars. I love it, but man, you just, you know, even at even at five speed, you got to be patient. There we go. Let's get another cleric. Now we've got more religion. That's going to stabilize the happiness a little bit. We've got four builders right now. Let's open up one of these houses. And we've only got... I know the firewood's low. Chill out. Jeez. We've only got enough stone for one of these right now. So let's release two of these folks. So we're just going to do one. We're going to start planting these crops. That's going to be great. We got corn. We got peppers. Um, we could bump up our stone cutters. Let's get those up to 10 so that we can boost our, uh, our stone. Let's get these folks back to full. Vendors. Yeah, I don't really... Traders, we can keep at one because we're not like actively moving materials, you know, all the time. Vendors, I think 10 is fine because the vendors, again, the vendors are the folks who, who work at the markets. We only have two of them right now. And uh, not only do they work at the markets, but they run around with these carts and they go and they collect materials from, you know, from various places, whether that be storage barns or or stockpiles. So I think I think 10 is fine between these two. Because we only have, we have this market, which is servicing the southern portion of Amesbury Port. And then we have the primary market, which is hitting this population up here. You know, also, <clears throat> I actually forgot. We need to continue our efforts up here to modernize these houses. So I think that's gonna be another effort once we get a little bit more stone. Look at this. Woo! Got a bunch of folks passing the physician, unfortunately, and a vendor. But we had enough in the labor pool to, to take that hit. This cemetery is down to 21. I wonder if... I have to look that up. I wonder if graves disappear after a period of time. Woo! Food's low. Food is very low. We'll hopefully recover that here with some crops. We've got three crop fields. Ooh, we've got a trader coming. Maybe they'll have something interesting. We'll take a look. We're ready for you, buddy. Let's see what we got. All right. Trade. Ooh, chickens. 400. I think, if I'm not mistaken, so they're four each. What is that, 400? Am I good at multiplication? I am. Let's do that. Let's get four chickens. That's going to be wonderful to have. We can have a uh, we can have a little chicken chicken field. We can grow chickens. Awesome. So we got cows. We got five cows, and those are doing well. Let's find a spot for our chickens. Look at this. Look at these peppers. Those look great. I love it. Those look great. Next to the corn. Look at us. <laughs> we have, like, no food, but, you know, we will soon. We will soon. Um, let's see if we can get... Let's see if we can get the chicken somewhere over here. 
maybe right here? I don't know. Let's take a look. It's gonna be a pasture. Not gonna be able to get a very big one. Hmm. It doesn't look great. Uh, let's see. Maybe we can get one over here. I don't want to cut too much into the nature preserve. You know what? Maybe it's time to put one up here. Maybe that's what we'll do. How big can we get over here? Ooh. Get a nice long one over here. 19 by 10. I think we should do that. Let's do that. Guys, we have like no food. <laughs> oh God. All right, it's all right, it's all right. It'll be fine, I promise. You can trust me. Where's that end, right there? Cool, and then maybe we can fit like a house there or something. Line up some, let's line up some houses. Perfect. Let's do those a little later, though. Looking good. Actually, we have enough. Let's uh, let's pop one right here. Let's just do it. Why not? Yolo. I promise I will never say YOLO in this game ever again. <laughs> it's fine. All right, they're gonna clear this area out. We're gonna get our chickens going. We're gonna get a house built. Looking good so far. We have a lot of laborers, so that's gonna make this process way easier. Look down here. Oh, look at that. We got that house built. It's looking good. All right, let's pop back up here. Let's keep an eye on this. It's looking good. This harvest is uh, is looking pretty good too, actually. It's looking really good. I guess we can have a path going around here too. Let's just do. Just to say that we did. Uh, we're getting close. All right. Let's go, folks. So close. This is going pretty well too. Look at all this. There's a lot of iron. Jeez Louise. This is all iron. That's crazy. It's great to see though. It's really good to see. Okay. This is going well. Ah, late autumn. Get the rest of that stuff. Look at that though, the food. Perfect. That's perfect. 3,900, that's great. That's so great to see that the food finally popped back up. Good, just means we can support our population. That's what I'm hoping, you know. We go through all this and we can't keep these people alive. That would not be good. All right, they're bringing the logs. Oh, we're getting there. Hey, maybe we'll get a little deer in the pasture too. Uh, all right, well, he's moved on to the house. Finish up that house. Finish up the chicken pasture. Hey, and it's 
<laughs> it's already got folks. Fisherman and farmer. Perfect. Look at that. Look at that. And we still have a lot of stone. You know what? Let's open this one up. Let's just do another one. DJ Khaled going on here. Another one. Just keep building. It's looking nice. Oh, we're so close. We're so close. Look at all these deer. Wow. Well, this is looking really good. So we'll build this out. We've got a we've got a number of chickens to pop into this pasture. Chickens uh, chickens grow pretty quickly. So that's going to be a really good addition. Plus, that'll give us feathers, which is awesome. We'll have chicken. I think we get eggs as well. And feathers. That's going to be great. We managed to get it a pretty decent size, so we'll be able to have a, a pretty healthy population of chickens in here. These folks are doing well. They're building that out quick. 4,200 food. We got a lot more firewood. Almost 400 firewood. That's great. We're in a much better position this time around. We had a, we had a bit of a scare last couple of episodes, but I think we're finally stabilizing. Look at that. Now we've got a pasture. Let's, uh, let's get some folks in here. Let's get some chickens. Do we have enough uh, herdsmen? We do. We're just waiting, I guess. All right. So they're going to move those chickens over. There they are. Hey, there they go. They are... Oh, well. <laughs> they're adventurous chickens. Just taking off on their own. Ah, oh, yes. Swimming chickens. Huh. All right. Well, that's... It's not the path I would have taken, but, uh, you know, to each his own. Be a hell of a thing if one of these fishermen caught it. <laughs> they throw their line in, catch a chicken. God. All right. Well, and up on the bridge. All right. That's, uh, that's a weird bug, but you know what? I just, I'll just accept it. It's fine. This house is going well. This person's freezing to death. And we have some chickens. Wow, look at that. We can have up to 31 chickens. Excellent. Well, let's check out this trading post. The last one went well. We don't need any of this. Sayonara, buddy. 31, that's a lot. We have a lot of chickens. All right, so we're not gonna need 31 chickens. Let's say... Uh, let's do 20. Let's keep 20 chickens. Perfect. Look at that. It's great. Well, there you have it, folks. We've got a new pasture. Got some chickens. Got a new little house. Everything's going well. I think, uh, I think we're going to wrap the episode up here. Thank you so much for watching. Again, if you like this content, please leave a like. Uh, when you engage with the content on YouTube, that's, uh, that's how the YouTube algorithm goes and sends this off to other people so that they can watch it. So I really appreciate uh, any thumbs up that you put on there. If there's something you want to see specifically, leave a comment. I read all the comments. Or I reply to all the comments. And uh, yeah, if you want to stick along for the ride, make sure to subscribe to my channel and uh, continue to see the content as I put it out. All right, everybody. See you in the next episode. Bye now.